Hey, uh, this is a review of a Joytech solar charger. Uh, it it's, uh, measures about 10 inch, uh, 10 inch width here, and uh, 10 inch by 6 inch. And uh, when you open it, it's all oh, it has these uh, magnets, so they kind of like snaps onto place. Uh, when you open it up, uh, it's made of three panels. Um, and these are, they claim these are uh, pretty high efficient compared to other brands. And I tested it on the, in the sun as well. And I, uh, I think it, it, it actually does have a higher efficiency. And, uh, I tried, uh, charging my iPad mini two, uh, which has about 12% battery left. And I was able to see about 1.8 amp being, uh, pulled from through these uh, solar panels and <clears throat> I think that's pretty high uh, current uh, and when I walked into the shade as soon as I walked into the shade it's uh, it becomes useless so uh, don't expect it to be I wouldn't really expect it to be used uh, like like under inside or indoors or uh, when you're when you're when you don't have a direct view of the sun it's it's going to be hard to use because it's not going to produce enough juice to power anything other than maybe uh, small, really tiny gadgets or stuff. Uh, let's see. So uh, there there's all these uh, hooks. So you can attach them to, for instance, your uh, backpack or somewhere where if you're if you're hiking or something, uh, and you can fold these. Oh, and uh, on the back here, there's also a very good uh, zipper pouch here where you can store your USB cables and stuff. Uh, um, this one came, in, this one was included with this uh, solar panel, solar charger. So you can put all your cables here and uh, or even your gadgets inside here and there are two USB ports here. Uh, here yes, you can see there are two USB ports yeah, it's hard to see, but uh, there's a LED light here indi indicating whether there is power or not. Uh, even though this lights up, it might not be a five full uh, five volt. So it it would be a good idea to actually uh, use a, a a power measuring device uh, such as the one I have. Uh, let me show you over oh, here. Oh yeah. So this is a cable that I used for the for my iPad, and uh, here's the. USB meter. Uh, I'll show you in another uh, video which uh, shows what kind of a display it has and uh, how it works while charging my iPad mini. Um, but other than that, uh, I think there's not really too much to say about it. Uh, it doesn't work indoors. I tried, uh, I tried opening this up. Uh, okay. Yeah, I tried uh, opening this like in directly under the light, and it doesn't it doesn't produce enough uh, electricity. So uh, don't expect to be using these like indoors again, or even if you're under like direct uh, light source other than the sunlight, it, it's gonna be hard to get enough power to power anything at all. So. Uh, but it'll be perfect for camping, uh, hiking, uh, or if you're on a long road trip, you might be able to like put these in, in the in the sunroof or somewhere. Uh, it'll it'll generate enough power to power your mobile devices. I think it'll do about two amp because I only used a one device and uh, measuring 1.8 amp is it's it's pretty. I think it's pretty high, so. Even even if it was uh, doing one amp per port, then I think that would be pretty good, uh, decent amount of power to charge your gadgets. Uh, so uh, that was the review of my of this uh, Toytech solar charger. If you have any questions, just uh, let me know and leave a comment. I'll try to answer it and test it. If you want me to test anything else or any kind of a configuration, uh, so thank you for watching. So here I'm holding the solar charger with connected to my iPad Mini 2 in uh, direct sunlight.
you can see that it's, it's charging at about 1.8586 amp. Uh, the power usage is 9.1 watts. That's pretty good. Uh, let me see if I can, how it looks like when, it, when I go into the shade. Now, as soon as I walked into the shade, the voltage drops and uh, you can barely use it to charge anything. Uh, so, you would actually need to be in uh, direct sunlight to make any use of this uh, wireless, uh, the, the uh, solar charger. So, right now I walked back into the sun, but uh, I think it's, there's an error in the, in the USB meter.